What's going on, Star Wars fam? It's your bro host, Daniel Miller. And I'm Chris Rines. And what is that? Hmm? Oh, it's the Star Wars C-3PO Does Not Like Sand hardcover book on sale today. I wonder if it's because it's coarse and irritating, but you know what? It's much better than that iPad of you watching all that Galaxy's Edge footage. Woo! Man, your edge envy was strong. It last was. Week, it was buddy. pretty. It was yeah. pretty rough, wasn't it, man? I mean, you know, I'm seeing Tommy Puig of Revenite Podcast and, and Star Wars Savage get to go. I'm seeing Dano go and 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 and, and Alex from from Star Wars Explained and him and Molly got to go. It's fantastic. Uh, I would love to. I would love. To, I would. I would. Well, it's good to see you back at yourself, you know? Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah. Even though I'm they not... got to make lightsabers, they, they got to did. drink the blue milk, and yeah, they did. They ate the Ronto wraps, but see, you're fine mm. now, right? Yeah, yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Yeah? I'm good, man. <laughs> I'm, you know, I'll, we'll go whenever we get to yeah, go, right? Yeah, we'll we'll exactly. just we'll go whenever we get to go. Yeah. We're just not going to get to go right now. Exactly. So, I mean... <laughs> you won't get to build a droid right now? Mm-hmm. We'll choose your lightsaber crystal at the yep. moment? Yeah. Look at that Ronto wrap. Yeah. Heard that blue milk was really something special. Yeah, I heard it was delicious, man. Mm-hmm. <laughs> He's not over it yet. Let's punch it. On shelves today, we have Darth Vader Dark Visions number 5. With this series, we get to see the many points of view that everyone in the galaxy views Darth Vader in. And this one has yet to disappoint. And we get to see it through the eyes of a lowly bartender. You mean it's not some crazy nurse this time? Oh, no. Not some crazy nurse. Hmm. Mm -mm. Oh. Now this one starts off with Darth Vader. And he is on the search for some rebels. And it's time to slaughter some rebel scum. What is wrong with me? What is wrong with me? So it's really time to slaughter this rebel scum. He needs to find these plans in order to save the armada of the Imperial fleet. God bless the Imperials. And yes. God bless the Empire. What the hell? Yes. <laughs> now on this unknown planet, it is full of deadly foliage. I mean, giant Venus flytrap looking things that Vader is just hacking away with his lightsaber like it's some kind of outback machete. So as I said before, Vader is on the hunt for these rebels and the plans they have that could eliminate the whole Imperial Armada. And we can't have that. Nope. We need to murder those traitorous rebel scum. <laughs> Well done. What's wrong with me? Anyway, <laughs> it leads Vader to this cantina, where a bartender is taking everyone's blaster at the door, Imperial and Rebel alike. Uh, hold on. There's some goofy bartender at a cantina, mm -hmm. and he's letting in Imperial soldiers mm -hmm. and officers, salt of the earth, mm -hmm. with Rebel scum, these terrorists, these, these, these criminals. That's right. Ridiculous. It is ridiculous, and Vader capitalizes on that moment. And thanks again for joining us for another Quick Shot of Bro Axiom here at Atomic City Comics on South Street in Philadelphia. And we like to keep you guys updated on everything that's happening with Bro Axiom. And we have a new show coming soon called The Sacred Texts, where we break down the Star Wars novels in their entirety, and it's going to be brought to you by our very own Daniel Leahy. Dude, they brought that green rabbit into this. Ooh, why are you doing that to yourself? That's Jackson. Oh my God. Anyway, also, we've got a new podcast coming out with Dan and myself called The Spoiler Run, where it's an extension of the quick shots where we go in depth on every comic that we reviewed for that week. Also, guys, you want to make sure to check out Unrefined Broaxium, our podcast, where you can find that on Spotify, iTunes, and Podbean. Also, make sure to check out Broaxium. You can follow us on YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Oh, and that reminds me, Chris, hmm. have you checked out the new Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order gameplay yet, dude? I have. 
There's spiders in it. But what about Saul? Can't do it. I love that Saul Guerrero's in it. Yeah. But there's spiders in it. Mm-hmm. Big ass spiders. They're pretty. I uh no. Uh, no. no? I'm going to get someone else to play that part for me. But I'm going to have to tell you right now mm. that this game is also sparking a prequel comic book mm -hmm. called Dark Temple. Yeah. I think it's a five-issue run. Can't wait. It's going to be exciting, guys. I hope there are no spiders in that. So make sure you check out Broaxium for all of that action, and may the Force be with you. Always. Seriously, I cannot mess with them spiders, man. I'm going to get someone else to play that game for me. I'll, I'll take care of it. I cannot do it. No. I, I got gotcha. you. Arachnophobia is a real thing. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>